in question 5 we have to solve the equation 6x is equal to 12 now the variable in this equation is x and if you observe the LHS we have a product of a constant term 6 and the variable x what we need to do is we need to separate the variable x and find its value and to do that what we can do is we can divide both the LHS and the RHS by 6 because that will remove this 6 from the LHS so let's do that let's divide both sides of this equation by 6 so what will we get so on the LHS we have 6x the original uh, LHS and we divide this by 6 and on the RHS we have 12 and we also divide this by 6 so on the LHS this 6 and the 6 uh, these two cancel out and we are left with only x and on the RHS we have 12 by 6 that is equal to 2 so x is equal to 2 is the answer um, is the solution of this equation and we can verify that it is correct if we substitute x equal to 2 into the equation we get 6x or 6 times 2 is equal to 12 which is correct now dividing both sides of the equation by 6 we could also have done this by simply saying take this 6 and take it to the right side into the denominator so from 6x is equal to 12 we could directly have written x is equal to 12 by 6 because we are taking the 6 to the RHS and if you're doing that then uh, on the LHS it is in the numerator so on the RHS it will be go into the denominator so 12 by 6 which is equal to 2 so what I did here is basically a shorthand way of what we did earlier by dividing both sides of the equation by 6. So that completes question 5 and the answer of this question is x is equal to 2. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.